Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Simonil Sar. Okay, I don't know, I said Sar. Okay, <laughs> so weird, I don't know. Anyways, today's video is all about the first time I skipped school in my life. Um, I've skipped school a lot of times, let's just keep it real. But that was the first time I ever did it in my life. Now, if you're a young kid, don't watch this video. And if you're above 18, go back to the first time you skipped school high school specific you skipped a period to go do something else okay and if you haven't done that then you haven't lived let's just it's just facts i'm sorry you just haven't you just wasted your entire high school career you're gonna die you're gonna come back live go to high school and then maybe skip a little bit and then you'll know what i mean okay because this is really classic now i guess anyway so I was in 10th grade and my best friend Devonshi was like, hey Simonil, I'm gonna go eat at this cool restaurant Chipotle that just opened. God, this is like a long time ago. I was in ninth grade. And my 10 year high school reunion, by the way, is coming up and I'm like, whoa, where did the time go? Cause I still feel like I'm like 22 on a good day. But usually I just feel like I'm 18. I'm not even gonna lie, okay? <laughs> Anyways, so. Gosh, what was this video? Oh, yes, okay. <laughs> okay, so my friend was like, let's go eat at Chipotle. It's a really cool restaurant, it just opened. I was like, cool, I wanna go. And then she's like, yeah, but you're gonna have to skip class because you're gonna have to skip uh, like the last uh, two periods, lunch and the one before. So like half the day we're skipping because we're gonna go hang out with her cousin and then her friend and we're just gonna chill and then we're gonna go eat at Chipotle. And I was like, you know what? I'm down. <laughs> and then, here's what we did. So she had an excuse, right? Because her cousin was there and, um, you know, she had like a parent and teacher note, whatever, like blah, blah, blah. She has to go. So she told the attendance ladies, who we were really cool with, by the way, both of us. She told attendance ladies that she's flying out to like, New York or something, okay? And it, this was a Friday, so like, she said she'll be back on Monday or whatever. So she had like, everything excused. And what an elaborate lie. Like, I'm flying out, okay? Anyways, and I, here's what I did. I'm such, never mind. Sneaky, okay, I was gonna say I'm such a sneaky person, but here's, here's what I did. I wrote a letter, a little note for myself, and I said, Seminole has her period. She's not feeling good. She has a lot of cramps. Signature of my mom. Gave it to the attendance ladies. I was like, yeah, my mom's waiting outside. Here's the letter. Deuces. <laughs> Literally. And they were like, oh, poor baby, feel better. I was like, I know. I'm just gonna go home and eat ice cream and watch The Notebook. I don't know, something like that, right? <laughs> I hate The Notebook, by the way. Ew, that is not, no. Anyways, so, well, hate is a strong word. I just don't, I just think it's dumb. Like, I don't know, whatever. Um, and if you don't know what the notebook is, actually, never mind, I'm not gonna explain it. Anyways, so, um, I skipped school. And it was the easiest thing to do. I told the attendance ladies that my mom is in the car. My mom was at work in like 20 miles away, okay? But I told her this and I gave her the letter and I have been forging my mom's signature since like fourth grade so your girl's kind of a professional at it but anyways i forged my mom's signature i gave him the letter i'm like bye and i go hoppity hop with my friend and her cousin in the car and we go to her friend's house right <clears throat> now we go there so it's been a while right we go there we pick up the baby because the her friends i mean her cousin's friend has a baby also so we put her in the car seat it takes a while right and then we go to chipotle Dude. <sighs> okay. I walk in and I'm like, whoa, this is cool. Like, what kind of food is it? And then my friend's like, oh, it's Mexican. I'm like, oh, that's cool. And I'm just like looking around and I see like a group of ladies sitting like a little on the corner. And I'm like, hey, I know one of them. And I'm like, I start walking towards them. I'm like, hey, I know all of them. And right when I'm about to say ha, hi, hi. I realized those are my attendance ladies and I just turn around and I freaking run, okay? And I am like, oh my God, oh my God. And I look back and Devonshi is having like an equally big heart attack because homegirl's supposed to be in New York right now, okay? And she's here in Chipotle with me who simultaneously 
also got her period that day and had really bad cramps and had to go home. And the attendant ladies are just chilling at Chipotle. Anyways, shout out to the Chipotle uh, employees in Fremont, California because those girls hid me and Devonshi in the bathroom. They were like, go, 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 go. I was like, we just skipped school. Those are attendance ladies. They're like, oh my God, oh my God, go to the restroom. Me, I was there for like a good like five minutes. I was like, I'm not going out. This is too much. This is too much. And then her cousin, uh, my, my friend's cousin called and she was like, yo, they left. You can come now. So we go out. I get my first bowl of Chipotle. And that's what, that's the first time I ate at Chipotle. That was the story. And that was also the first time I skipped school. So I could, I'm actually gonna rebrand this. We, what's the word? We title this into the first time I ate at Chipotle and the first time I skipped school. Cause I did both those things on the same day. Do I regret it? <laughs> Absolutely not. Are you kidding me? It's great. Like, okay, no, it's not great. But okay, <laughs> here's the thing. Do fun things like that in your life. I'm not saying like drop out of school and do drugs or whatever. No, do not do that. Do not do that. But do fun things. Make memories. Make like be spontaneous, you know, because you don't know how that thing is going to turn out. Like I just thought I was going to go eat Chipotle and like 12 years later, I'm telling the entire world about that one time I skipped school. I went to Chipotle and you know what? These are beautiful memories, you know, so be spontaneous in your life. Do fun stuff. Break rules. They're there because sometimes, you know, you got to break them or else. Yeah, just I think we're done here. Okay, bye bye. Oh. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And tell me what was the first time you ate at Chipotle or you uh, skipped school. I would uh, love to know. Anyways, I will talk to you later. Zoop.